Hi, I'm Lou, and today I'm going to show you how to build a carrot rifle. To load the gun, just take your carrot, stick it in the end, cut it off, and then use a pole to stick it in. Shove it all the way down. Now you're ready to shoot. Here's a carrot versus a cardboard box. The carrot went in the front side and out the back side, right there. It helps lubricate the valve and the barrel a little bit to spray a little WD-40 down the barrel. Carrot versus milk jug full of water. We actually put a hole in the milk jug. And if you look carefully, the carrot's inside. Carrot versus pop can. Definitely put a big old dent in it. Carrot for distance. This carrot gun can be made for about $15 worth of parts at the hardware store in about 15 minutes of time. Let's see how. Let's take a look at the parts we'll need. This is all called CPVC piping. This is a half inch, five feet long, three quarter inch, five feet long. These two are three quarter inch elbows. We've got three three quarter inch T's, a three quarter inch valve, and this strange little guy is a three-quarter, one-half, three-quarter T. This is a standard air compressor fitting with a three-eighths screw-in. This is Teflon tape that you'll use to wrap that. And this is CPVC cement that we'll use to glue all this stuff together. Now we're going to cut our three-quarter inch tubing. You can use a wood saw or a hack saw. I have a chop saw, so I'll use that. We'll need three pieces at eight inches long. One piece at five inches long. And five pieces at an inch and a half long. Then we need a half inch piece of the half inch tubing. Now lastly, we need to cut our 5 inch piece with a slot so that it'll fit on top of here. So the slot needs to be maybe 5 8 deep and 3 16 wide, something like that. You can use a uh, hacksaw or whatever. I'm going to use a bandsaw. With the five inch tube on the valve, go ahead and drill a hole through both of them. Put a small nail in it and bend it down on the other side so it can't come out. And if you want, you can saw off the wings. They're no longer needed. Here are all the pieces and we're ready to put it together. Now using our CPVC cement, it comes with a little cotton ball type thing in the end, on the inside. You just rub the inside of one piece, the outside of another, push them together, and twist. That's done. It's a little tricky to get this piece in. You go ahead and you have to get both insides done. 
and both outsides. And then put this piece in all at once. Do the same thing again here. This little guy you can just put on your pinky finger, dupe it up, and then the hole. Shove it in. When you put this guy on, just make sure it's facing down, lined up with the rest of this. And the gluing is all done. Now take your air compressor connector and wrap the threads with Teflon tape maybe four or five times around. And just tear that off. This is not meant to go in that tube, but it will. So you just kind of press and turn. And then once you get it started, use a wrench and tighten it on up. Thank you for watching and good luck making your carrot rifle.